Mr. Baker, could you answer some questions for reporters? Ms. Mr. Baker, are you the subject of an FBI leak investigation? Mr. Baker, did you handle the dossier? Did you warn Deputy Attorney General Rosenstein that there was exculpatory information before he signed the final surveillance warrant? Mr. Baker, will you take our questions? We know Bruce Orr was giving information to the FBI. We know Christopher Steele was giving information to the FBI. We also learned today that there was another source um, giving information directly to the FBI that dealt with the Russian investigation. So um, we felt that was important. There's some other good information we got on some other issues that, again, we hope this transcript will get out soon. So, I mean, the kind of information that the American people need to know, uh, and they need to know it as soon as possible. So uh, this was, in my mind, maybe the most informative, I think Mark yeah. would agree, the most informative and best deposition we've, we've had yet as far as learning new things and confirming uh, confirming some, some concerns and suspicions we had um, for a long time. What Jim uh, said is, is probably the most informative uh, interview that we've had to date. Uh, some of the things that uh, were shared were explosive in nature. I mean, I, I, I couldn't believe that I was hearing some of the testimony that uh, here in the United States uh, that the DOJ and FBI were involved with uh, based on that without sharing details. I did, we did learn one other thing, and that is, is uh, based on some testimony today, uh, some of the footnotes, uh, FISA footnotes that were in the, the Democrat memo uh, were inconsistent with the testimony we heard today, which would, would shed light on perhaps uh, the FBI knowing uh, more about the, the potential bias and motivations behind those sharing information.